Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? The unit is a cleaning sam. Hawthorne brought it on board some cycles ago, I'm sure with the intent to modify it, but I've never seen it up and running. Alex likely recorded progress notes detailing his efforts to modify Sam. If you check the terminal in your captain's quarters, we may be able to determine what work remains in order for Sam to properly operate. Goodbye. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? Yes, Captain. Beginning playback now. There's... there's viscera and death everywhere. Gunfire, gnashing teeth, the unemployed. For law's sake, if anyone's receiving this, please send help. What? Uh, no, 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 no! Captain. We are now capable of accessing the Roseway landing pad. Also, corporate protocol requires that all distress signals include a list of key personnel for retrieval. The embedded names are Anton Crane, Vaughn Cortez, and Orson Shaw. I request you do not wake me if I am sleeping upon your return. Orbit above Roseway, Captain. Can we talk? This Roseway business smells. Something tells me things didn't end well for the guy who made the distress call, and whoever or whatever got him will be waiting for us. Just a little caution. Could be a reason no one's picked up this job yet. They don't give medical degrees to dummies, Captain. Anyway, we might as well take a look out there, see if we can get the jump on whoever's waiting for us. Please avoid damaging our... Don't they have anybody that greet arrivals? For paperwork or ticketing or whatever? Captain, something bit them. Something with more teeth than is strictly necessary.
They left their own outside to die? Was it that bad? I done had enough of this shit. I'm just the fucking tarmac guard. No one said nothing about fighting no raps. Distress call from here? Shit. They told me that weren't allowed. Got me. I just do what I'm told, and I was told not to do such. Scientists. Name of Anton Crane. Someone said he's panicking inside the comm center. What do you think? I'm the landing pad guard. I was standing out on the fucking tarmac. Hell of a job until all this. Anything else you'd like to know? Oh, before I forget. Anti-Cleos makes the best pharmaceuticals in Halcyon. Better than nature. Not like that crap spacer's choice pedals. If you've come to end my life, let's be on with it. Oh, not actually one of them, are you? Yes, yes. Anton Crane, lead scientist here. I must apologize if my call diverted you. I, uh, may have panicked. Everything's under control now, though, truth be told. I'm not at liberty to discuss the nature of the work I'm doing here. Suffice it to say that its importance to me, uh, to the colony, is immeasurable. My research may not quite fall within legal parameters, so I'm under orders to maintain wireless silence. However, having your head used as target practice can addle one's thinking. I cut the call immediately once I'd gathered my wits. The Home Office can't know what's happening here. And take great joy in doing so, I might add. I suppose it can't hurt. If I don't get that research back, my life is over regardless. We were tasked with formulating a new and improved dental gel. One cannot exaggerate the benefits of good dental hygiene. May I continue? While doing research on enzymes specific to the Raptodon's digestive system, we developed an additive which we subsequently discovered to be the most effective appetite suppressant ever. Not just any diet toothpaste, the ultimate diet toothpaste. Hours ago, a group of vicious malcontents fell upon us, shot up our labs and loosed our research subjects, the Raptodons. If those Cretans get their hands on my research, well, they'll need not kill me. Yes, but don't kill the mother if it's avoidable. We've need of her to replenish our stocks. I think there's gas in the lab somewhere that can be used to put them out. The research is in the safe in my office. You'll have need of my code and key card. The lab's entrance is in the side of a hill. You can't miss it if you just follow the road. You'll pass by the town's original... by the Grand Architect. Jameson, he's in the old lab. That would surely lighten the weight on my conscience, as I am held to account for the well-being of every scientist here. Too many have been lost. Too many black marks against my name, as it were. And far too much paperwork. Of course they do. Please don't mistake my ambition for callousness.
It's just that their constant complaining can begin to wear. They refuse to see the opportunity afforded us here. It's infuriating. I don't know about Dr. Crane's research, but we ought to find Mr. Jameson. He's got to be all alone and scared. You picked a hell of a day to visit. I'm Vaughn. Vaughn Cortez. Uh, Dr. Vaughn Cortez. But just Vaughn's fine, really. Over in the main labs. I rabbited back here when I realized I was hearing gunshots, not blown fuses. We've been cooped up in here, I don't know, hours? Too long. I have to get back to, to work. Sure, loyal company fella. That's me. Auntie knows best. Look, I don't want to go back out there, but there's a thing I gotta do. I had to leave an experiment running at the lab. Something I've been working on a long while. Something that could really get me ahead. Know what I mean? I've been extracting organic compounds from raptodons. Compounds that have, um, uh, benefits. Extracting how? No, wait, maybe I don't want to know. In certain social situations. Personal situations. Where you might want to, um, enhance your charisma. Seriously. Captain, I believe he's making enraptured. It's an aphrodisiac. Wrapped musk is the main ingredient. What? No? I mean, yes, I'm getting the musk. With Monarch Embargo, the price is sky high, but I'm not making the drug. The results are outside the margin of error. Technically. Sure. Of course. Our lab's south of here, down the road. Not the old public lab, the one past that, built into the mountainside. The newer lab is built for, um, more sensitive work. We mostly use the old lab for storage these days. My equipment's in the lower levels, way in the back. I have a big room all to myself. Dissection tables and whatnot. It should have been running this whole time. Just grab the results and bring them here. Great! Uh, this is really gonna save my ass. This should prove a worthwhile endeavor. Ooh. If I had a look at those yellow walls all day, I'd make a point to sleep on the roof. I assume. Do me a favor and let me finish this, will you? And then make it quick, please. Aren't you with the brutes that attacked our lab? Aren't you here to pillage our supplies and leave our corpses to the raptodons? Oh, well, good luck. Now, if you got the carpet in there, it's just a matter of horses. Uh, of course, because I didn't... I am Orson Shaw, Chief Behavioral Scientist. I was brought in to study the Raptodons. I was to ensure that, should a problem arise, our team is adequately equipped to deal with them. They are insatiably hungry, absolutely impossible to control in any fashion, and indeed appear to be powered entirely by hate. No amount of studying will enable us to control them, or even slightly sate their aggression. In 
Indeed. Now that you fully grasp the gravity of the situation, I wonder if you might do me a favor. I left schematics in our storage facility. As far as I know, the security commander hasn't found them yet. I admit I'd feel better were they returned to me. Say, uh, you wouldn't happen to have a tube of thermal paste on you, would you? Blast! Well, good luck. I hope I see you back here in one piece. Must be where Mr. Shaw's been working. System security.
Okay. Enough of you. Mercy on you. I won't. Nice of them to put up a sign. We're just gonna walk in. I mean, it's a. Who the you? Yeah, you. Get over here. You care to explain what you're doing here? Did you miss the big sign outside? That I am. Name's Porter. If Doc Crane did send you, I'd be glad for the help. Bad news is, we haven't been able to clean these outlaws out of the lab. Good news is, they haven't been able to escape, neither. For now. I reckon they got no backup. On the other hand, we don't neither. And our mechanicals all went haywire for some damn reason. Damn mechanicals have always been more trouble than they're worth. The garage and the front door are it. These bastards got in through the vent system, but we locked that down. They're not getting back out that way without a security key card. They'd need to take mine. Or make a new one in my office, I guess. 
Why you want to know that? One level down across from the cafeteria. But I locked it up, and I got the only key card. To get in, they'd have to blow it. We'd hear. Well, no. But like I said, to get it open, they'd have to bust the lock. Who, me? Or you mean the lab in general? Soap or something? I don't know. Years back, they made antibiotics. You could maybe ask Doc Crane what he does all day. If it was illegal, the company wouldn't ask us to do it. Sometimes violence is the only way. I think you could jimmy that one proper, Captain. Doesn't look too tough. Oh, clever. I'm gonna guess that all the nothing in that safe isn't what we were expected to find.
You! Oh, good. You're not shooting at me. That's a start. It's been a bit of a day, so I'll get to the point. Yes, I have Crane's research. No, I'm not giving it back. Sorry to disappoint you. Yes, I imagine he does. But we all have problems. It is the human condition. I am myself ensnared in this wretched place. You want to kill me. I don't want to die. Therefore, it is in my best interest to negotiate with you. Help me get out of here, and I will pay you for my life. You're asking a great deal from me. This research is my only bargaining chip. The first thing I need is a key card to unlock my door. Then I'd need you to clear me a path out of here. There are two ways out. The quickest is through the front door, but Clio Security's bottled up in there. If you don't want to shoot them, I suppose you could talk to them. The other way out is through the loading bay. But you'd have to clear out the rafts for me. Then I could just slip out the back, sight unseen. Give me a little credit. We are not bandits. We do not steal research. We liberate it. So a few scientists were caught in the crossfire. I will not be accountable for every idiot who wanders in front of my gun. All wars have casualties. I regret taking a life, but we were doing them a mercy. Better to die than live in a state of slavery. We are all of us trapped. You, me, the scientists. This is not a colony. It is a slave camp. Yes, we raided the lab, shot some guards. Killed a few scientists in the crossfire, but it was all for a higher cause. All wars have casualties. I regret taking a life, but we were doing them a mercy. Better to die than live in a state of slavery. I prefer freedom, fighter. But I will not quibble over semantics. Come on now. Do you want to be dull and boring and servile like everyone else? Or do you want to break some rules? Because Crane is a tool. Because no good deed goes unrewarded. Because doing me a good turn is the honorable and decent thing. Take your pick. The research I carry is valuable. I am willing to go halves with you. You might be the first stroke of luck I've had all day. Thank you. I'm in your debt. Take your time. I am, to my chagrin, not going anywhere. Survive and the weak perish. I would ask what was on your mind, but the answer is obviously me.
broke. We saw everything. I would ask what was on your mind, but the answer is obviously me.
I would ask what was on your mind. I would ask what was on your mind, but the answer is obviously me. Finally! I've never been so pleased at the sight of an open door. Please tell me you've cleared a way out of here. So you have. I am much obliged. And now, if you do not mind, I have had quite enough of this wretched place. Good. I never trust a freelancer who works for free. Orphans. Is that what you are calling yourself now? Here. Let it never be said that I do not reward good work. Oh, really? And why, pray tell, would I do a thing like that? Your point is well taken. I would rather not spend the rest of my days looking over my shoulder for the shadow of my headhunter. Here, take the damned research. Tell Crane I hope he chokes on it. Gosh, this is... Please say we don't gotta walk through that.
That wasn't a load bearing wall. Unexpected. We got a fight on our hands. Here I go! I'll take your confession now! you in the name of the law. How the hell did you get in here? No, not the... I don't care about the beasts. I care about the front door. This is an egregious breach of protocol. How'd you get in? Damnable beasts. At least I'm not trapped here anymore. I'll see you back at town.
longer a man of the cloth. You've returned. What news? Please tell me you've recovered my research. Without my work to focus on, I find myself tending towards darker paths of inquiry. That is wonderful news. I'd feared the worst. Not in this colony, there isn't. But success here will get me to Byzantium. I'll have recognition, money, proper facilities. It's the only place to lead a life of meaning in the system. You've returned. What news? Please tell me you've recovered. My research? Please tell me you've recovered it. That's... You can't possibly understand the enormity of what you've done for me. And what, pray tell, is the status of our raptodons? Capital. Excellent. If we're done here, I'd like to get back to work. You understand. Actually, there is something else. Um, why do you suppose Auntie Cleo's would want to market diet toothpaste to the lower classes? Yes, but that doesn't quite ring true. There's something amiss here. It nags at me like a sore tooth, but I can't for the life of me figure out why. I suppose you've earned it. Oh, hello. Uh, why do you seem familiar? Have we met? I'm just quite selective about what information I choose to retain. That said, yes, I recognize you. Have you retrieved my schematics yet? What a relief. You hold months of work in your hands. Anton would have just given them to Porter without a second thought. What a waste of potential that would have been. Hmm. Sadly true. Contraband does tend to fetch a high price among the colony's ne'er-do-wells. So be it. I'll buy them off of you. Much obliged. Here are your bids. Now, let's see here. Attach this, twist that, apply a little pressure, and... Voila! I can finally call this little side project complete. Thank the law. Oh, hmm. I can't be caught with this. Uh, you take it. If R&D buys the schematics from me, perhaps I'll get you the first model, hot off the presses. I'll, uh, call you? Yes, I'll call you.
Any news? On the thing we spoke about? You know, that thing? Don't keep me in suspense. Did you get my stuff? I mean, not mine. This is for other parties. Buyers. This is gonna make me so popular. I mean, with the people who buy it, not by using it. Because I'm not. Only for testing purposes. Quality control. You would, right? Take this. You earned it. If you run into me again after all this is over, maybe I'll have more. Pleasure doing business with you.